Guy 7 was the only chopper in the air to capture this silver SUV driving recklessly throughout Albuquerque. Police say Cordero Jefferson swerved in and out of traffic with a lot of near misses until this pursuit came to a sudden terrifying end when Jefferson crashed head on into an innocent driver. Sadly, it's not the first time this month that Sky 7 has seen something like this. Last Tuesday, Albuquerque police say John Northrop was a menace on city streets, driving very fast, often in the wrong direction, as you could only see from Sky 7. Then, the very next day, APD says someone spotted Jeremiah Baldwin, a man wanted for sexual assault warrants. He also took off, and again, Sky 7 got exclusive video of the high-speed chase between Albuquerque and Glorietta and its dramatic ending when state police spun him out. After seeing footage like this again and again, just slamming into two other vehicles. Oh, wow. Many in Albuquerque say enough is enough. I think it's awful. It frustrates me. Especially because it's not just their lives in jeopardy. For Jane Simmons, her grandchildren's lives are at stake too. I'm more frightened when I have them in the car. You know, if something should happen, when they're there. As for the driver today, Jefferson walked away from the crash just fine, but was caught a short time later and now faces charges. And two people had to go to the hospital after today's crash. One of them actually had to be cut out of the car. No word on how they're doing tonight. In Albuquerque, Megan Cruz, KOAT Action 7 News.